All right, you let's start. Let's do it again. <laughs> Come on, you let's work it out. Work it. Work. Work it out. Waka waka. <laughs> now, nah, today is the holy day of rest. As I told you last week, as I am preaching, praising or worshiping the Lord, I am truly resting. Big rest. So it's more like rest up. Rest, rest and rest. <laughs> oh, rasta, rasta under my wig. <laughs> <laughs> all right you all that was a little little point i told you i love a good laugh laughing is medicine according to the scriptures <laughs> well i'm laughing and i'm serious at the same time though <laughs> yes heavy no shalom alechem my friend watching i love you back yes with the love of the lord now relax <laughs> let's express our joy in the lord let's celebrate <laughs> how about that I hope you had a great week with the Lord, and you know what I mean by that. I hope you are doing great right now. Are you trying your best? <laughs> That's fine. That's really fine. Keep it up. <laughs> Welcome to my official YouTube channel in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Welcome to Afro Gospel Show. Afro Gospel meaning the Gospel of the Lord Jesus Christ, discovered by an African woman that was in 2011. And today, in 2020, I'm so glad I'm still in love with the Lord. Yes, my friend, you're right. I'm here to pump you up, to pump you up once again with the word of God. <laughs> because I have tried ignorance before and I don't ever want it no more. The Lord Jesus educated me and he's still educating me. And let me tell you, my friend. Even though education is usually expensive, Jesus does it for free. That's why I'm sharing, you know. I'm sharing. Mm. <laughs> it's good to share God. <laughs> Come on, let's pray. Oh, dear God, Abba Yahweh, in the name of Yeshua HaMashiach, with the power of the Holy Ghost, Ruach HaKodesh, we come and bow down our heads before you once again to tell you thank you, thank you, Abba Yahweh. Thank, thank you so much from the bottom of our hearts. Thank you for protecting us against evil. Thank you for keeping our feet from falling. Thank you for keeping our hearts from fainting. Thank you so much. And we can never say that enough, dear God. Oh, dear Heavenly Father, you know how much we, we can feel so squeezed in this life on earth. Sometimes we feel so squeezed like lemons and we want to scream, but we choose to shout hallelujah. We choose to shout glory be to you, dear God, because we trust you and we believe that you are fulfilling your promises in our lives each and every day. Dear Heavenly Father, we know that you love us and we know that you still love the world. Today we want to remember that it is also written that God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believeth in him shall never perish but have everlasting life. Dear Heavenly Father, we know that you tell us in the Bible to, to follow the instructions of the government concerning uh, this pandemic or concerning any kind of, of troubles in the society. But we pray that this COVID-19 will never stop freedom of churches, will never stop people from worshiping their God. We pray, Heavenly Father, that all the people who are affected by this virus or any kind of other disease or illness will experience your, your healing power today and right now because we know that our Lord Jesus Christ was wounded for our transgressions. He was bruised for our iniquities. The chastisement for our peace was upon him and by his stripes we are healed. We pray that today again in the name of Jesus, with the blood of Jesus, with the fire of the Holy Spirit, to you, dear Heavenly Father, Abba Yahweh. Amen. <laughs> All right, sure. Yes, my friend watching, I hope you too have accepted the Lord Jesus Christ in your life. And if not, do it right now. So you too can see the light at the end of the tunnel. 
<laughs> Jesus is the light at the end of the tunnel. Jesus is the light of the world and of all creation. <laughs> yes, be bold and ask the Lord to come into your hearts. Yes, my sister, or my brother, my son, my daughter, <laughs> auntie, uncle, grandma watching. <laughs> come on, make speed. <laughs> Haste. Stay not in the darkness. I can't wait to see you two fooling the fool who think he's fooling you by telling you that uh, you don't deserve God's love. The devil is a lie. But don't worry. When Jesus says yes, nobody can say no. When Jesus says yes, nobody can say no. <laughs> you remember this one? Wait a minute. Bring it back. <laughs> That's another gospel classic. Yes. <laughs> Beyond now. It's Michelle. I think it's oh, Michelle. I have so many of them in my heart. I'm going to share. I told you I'm going to share. It might cheer some struggling hearts out there. Amen. <laughs> yes. All right, you will. Um, yes. Um, my friend watching me too, I can testify one more time. I'm so glad that the Lord has been good to me this week. <laughs> First of all, my baby daughter, Imani, she has birthday. So I'm going to sing for my daughter right now. She's 22nd in 2020. I'm so glad. So a happy birthday to you, my baby money. Happy birthday to you, my dear, wonderful, lovely daughter. Et ces mots sont ceux-ci que Jésus te porte chaque seconde de ta vie, oh ma chérie. Qu'il t'aide à vivre, que tu chantes sa gloire, que tu vives pour lui. Sois okay. <laughs> heureuse, Marie-toi. Je te, je te souhaite le bonheur. Sois heureuse, raisonnablement heureuse sur la terre, parce qu'on ne peut pas être parfaitement heureuse. Hein. Mais euh, sois raisonnablement heureuse sur la terre. Et toi et ton frère, Kevin. <rire> C'est ton anniversaire, ma chérie. Que Jésus-Christ te bénisse. Amen. Yes, I can't wait. They are coming soon. Emmanuel and Kevin are coming soon. I can't wait. And, and I pray, pray already that the Lord will protect them on their way to Lausanne. <rire> Yes, they're coming. And I'm so glad this week I could go and purchase the Sofia demo test. I just wanted to make sure I already have it at home. And uh, I'm going to perform it after, you know, the visit of my uh, daughter and my kid and my, of my daughter and my son. Uh, because I need to practice a little longer maybe uh, and, just, uh, and just try the demo test in spite of the noises in this building. You know, it's really, really bad really bad and uh, the Lord knows I'm not exaggerating this is really little compared to what I'm I'm going through um, but uh, you know they're trying to destroy my black brain <laughs> but it's not gonna happen because I I played the precious blood of Jesus again there every second I played the precious blood of Jesus again them every second and I know that we will prevail I hope so <laughs> I believe in the Lord I trust Jesus he knows exactly what's happening but I can't wait to go and pass my exam of course I'm going to keep you updated you know I always film everything I hope I'm going to succeed because if I succeed the demo test which is an official one it means I can go pass my exam so <laughs> I love PowerPoint program and I'm thankful that the Lord uh, is helping me. <laughs> All right, my friend, I hope you too can testify about the goodness of the Lord uh, to you this week. And uh, now um, uh, let's come to the quote of the day. <laughs> Remember, I love to read the word of God to you. Well, today I'm thinking about the book of... Um, oh no, let's play today. Let's play a little... I'm just going to read the quote and you will have to guess or try to find out where it is located so you can open your Bible one more time today. <laughs> Let's read our digital Bible together. <laughs> Judge not that you be not judged. For with what judgment you judge, you shall be judged. And with what measure you meet, it shall be measured to you again. And why beholdest thou the mote that is in thy brother's eye, but considerest not the beam that is in thine own eye? Or how wilt thou say to thy brother, Let me pull out the mote out of thine eye? And behold, a beam is in thine own eye. 
Thou hypocrite, first cast out the beam out of thine own eye, and then shalt thou see clearly to cast out the moat out of thy brother's eye. Mm -hmm. This one is a well-known one too. I love this one. I remember the first time I heard this one that was in Long Beach, California, where I got baptized in this church. That was fantastic. And uh, this quote, I remember, it did impress me a lot. It's simple. Conclusion is, nobody is perfect, so don't you judge. Don't judge. Don't judge nobody. And uh, please don't hate because you can't, you know. <laughs> In the world, people would just tell you, mind your own business, you know, just, just, you know, take care of your stuff. <laughs> all right, you all, now it's Sabbath praise, but before I start, I want to give thanks to all my subscribers, and of course, I want to deliver them a proper entertainment. Mm -hmm. Yes, today I want to sing in German, I want to remix the Afro Gospel number 66 called Dein Wert, meaning your value. <laughs> I wrote this song like uh, five years ago using the dance hall rhythm instrumental 2015. <laughs> Let's remix this one. <laughs> <laughs> 